don't even see all the people, though. I don't know. Oh, wait. There he is. He's still just standing in the front. What is he doing? Oh, my God. Everyone's in a group right now. Oh, my God. This would be the perfect time to take the shot. Oh, my God. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to DOJ. Jumping in here for some more criminal activity, this time with our favorite guy, Agent 48, who's back from Mexico. And it's good to see him. It's good. He's got a little bit of a tan, even though it doesn't show in game. But he, I promise he has a little bit of a tan. So how I want to do these episodes moving forward is more on a realistic premise of how the game is actually ran. So we'll go through and uh, in the intro, kind of go over what the target looks like and uh, all that stuff. So on screen right now, you're going to see what the target looks like and is driving. These are screenshots from social media. So we've been able to extract these. Now the client who has ordered the Hitman has told us that the target is going to be at Del Perro Pier all day, hanging out in some type of car meet that is going to have security and a whole bunch of stuff. It's supposed to have fireworks and just kind of like this big event. So this is where we're going to be and this is where the client wants it done. So looking at these, you can see that he has a blue top on. I guess it could be white with like blue print. Uh, tattoos on his arms, tan pants and uh, white, yeah, tan pants and then beige boots. He's well, or he has a yellow car uh, with like the white walled tires and that should be pretty easy to stand out. Now there's going to be a whole bunch of other people there. So hopefully we can pick him out of the crowd. Now again, with these setups with Age of 48, when I actually go into a place that I don't know about, I have to set it up and we got to spend some time looking around. So it's going to be a little bit of time in the start uh, where we have to go through and trying to figure out exactly what we're going to do with this uh, contract. But we're going to make it happen. All right. So let's go ahead and jump into this with some 48 and see what we can get into. And we're going to go ahead and take off. Before we do this, though. Oh, shit. There's gas at the end of the fucking pier right here at Fire Station 8. I'm going to just go steal their gas. Because if it's right there, dude, we're not going to go all the way to a gas station. Fuck that. I'm just going to go steal theirs. Okay, just stop in the middle of the road. That's totally cool. In the drafter, uh, what is that, 8F? Yeah. Been a minute since I used this car. I usually only use it with 48, but I'd like to start using it more just because it's a nice car. I had no idea that they had a gas station down here, dude. If I would have known that, I would have been stealing their gas like a motherfucker. Oh, shit. Oh, we out here. Hopefully none of these guys. You ain't gonna get mad at me, right? I'm, I'm off my vacation, so I don't wanna... I don't wanna step on anyone's toes. Unless I'm chopping them off, of course, but... You are so right. You are so right. Oh, perfect timing, my guy. Have a great day. Hopefully you saved some lives. That's a good... That's a good lifeguard right there, if I've ever seen it. Alright, let's take off out of Dodge. I probably don't want to be speeding too much because I don't know if there's going to be any LEO in the surrounding areas. There is a regular patrol going on as well, too. So we should probably be a little bit careful about preceding units that might be in the area under security detail or whatnot. We're just going to get through this. If we get through this faster, we get down there. I need to be able to see what is going on. I need to know where people are at. I need to know how many people there are. That is where I need to know what is... If you don't get the fuck out of... You don't have a helmet on. You're, like, not even really biking the bike. You're just kind of floating, it seems like, guy. You need to get a helmet. Helmet for safety. You see me with this seatbelt? You should have a helmet on. All right, we're just going to speed. I'm going to throw the seatbelt on because I know all the people who watch the streams are literally just... The only thing they see in their mind right now is a seatbelt logo. Wishing they could access a chat just to be able to... Fucking drop it. Oh, Lord. What a PTSD experience. Okay, so we're in the area now. Let's, uh... You know what? I'm gonna park on this road right here. Here we go. We got a nice little cutty back alley. So I think the best thing for us to do... Let's roll up our windows. How did they even get down in the first place? I don't... I don't remember putting my windows down okay let's auto lock I don't know why that car alarm is going bananas in the background so right now we do have weapons on us but what are you doing bro god I was gonna say you broken piece of shit um we don't we do have weapons on us but we're not gonna be doing any shots right now Ooh, ooh. I see helicopter <laughs> that awkward moment when you run around the corner 
and you just see helicopters and you're like, and eh, nope. That's what concerns me about this is we might have to take a sniper shot. I really hope that's not a real helicopter. Oh, this is going to be so much better to get a view, dude. Oh, hell yeah. We just got to play it cool. No running or anything. You know what I mean? Just play it cool. I need to get my phone so that way I can see what's going on over there. Okay. I see where I want to go and I see where I'm going to go. There's this like cement. Oh, shit. That's a cop and his dog on the corner right there. Okay, the amount of helicopters that's above us is absurd, dude. Okay, let's go ahead and see what's going on. I have a feeling if I do need to take uh, a sniper shot, this is going to be the area to do so. Oh, no. The amount of event security is insane right now. I don't see anything on the beach. I'm in a pretty cutty. Why are the binoculars multicolor, dude? Oh. Oh, no. Dude, there's no way they can see me. There's no way they can see my head on the other side of this vent, dude. Oh, this is perfect. All I knew is at the pier, and we are just cutty ass doing this right now, dude. All right, so what I'm thinking we, we're going to have to do is we'll probably have to get some different outfits for 47. I want to I wanna kind of maybe go a little full board into this. I don't know. I don't see the target's car, nor do I see the target, but I see a heavy concentration of law enforcement in the area. They actually just seem to keep pouring out from this, the back of this building or something. I don't know if, where, I want to know where the event is actually at. That's what I need to know. So I might have to go up there and uh, drop all the weapons and kind of just go up and, and look like a normal person. Maybe put on like a beach outfit or something, you know what I mean? This is the spot to go to if I want to use binoculars though, because they will not see shit. Yes, I am bald as fuck, but in the end of the day, oh my god, there's so many people down here that we're going to lose a little bit of textures, but that's okay. Hopefully they all don't have fucking cars, because if they do, it's going to be so bad. Uh, so what I need to do is I'm going to have to do an outfit change. So I'm going to have to go in the back of my trunk. Okay. I think I got it. Because at this point, I, I'm <laughs> I'm running out of idea. I, need, I needed a hat. Okay. So we're kind of just at this point with him. I think he looks pretty good. I think he looks super low profile, which is uh, what we were looking for. I'm just going to play it cool. We're going to walk past everyone. They're literally just all... I think they're having like a car meet or something. I don't know what the event is, to be truthfully honest. This looks like some type of... I'm just going to play it cool. We're just going to walk past. I think my uh, my walk style definitely helps kind of seal the deal and like just no need to pay attention to him because it's just weird enough to look at and be like, huh, maybe not. I'm going to go to the bathrooms right here. Okay, that's not a command. I was hoping that we would have a command there, but that's def that wasn't it. Let's see what I could do. We could barbecue. It'll look like I'm at least using the, uh... <laughs> It'll at least look like I'm using the sink instead of just standing here. Fucking A. Okay, I'm hearing voices now, so I can actually hear people. I really wish there was a way... I wish there was a way to, like, wash hands or something. I'm, I'm fucking cooking in a sink, dude. Oh, I love it. God. Oh my god, and there's medical here, too. I mean, I guess at a car meet, you would definitely need medical. That sounds, sounds about right. Is there really nothing that I can use here? I think I have an idea here. I think I want to make this a little more sophisticated. So what I'm going to do, I think I'm going to bring in a boat. I'm going to try to park the boat underneath the pier. I want to, I want 47 to have, I'm sorry, I want 48 to have a good way to escape. And I want him to have several ways to escape. I mean, he'll have his car, which he might be getting shot at if they see me take the shot. If I want to come up close and personal, why does that look like two more people right there? Those guys, those guys look out of, oh shit, yeah they are. Oh, they have this bitch. Holy shit. I have not walked out to this side yet. It is quiet over here. Most of the shit's popping off in the parking lot. 
Another car rolling up. So what I'm going to need to do is I think I'm going to need to get a boat. I'm going to need to park that underneath the pier. So that way, if I do need to jump off the pier, I'm jumping down to the boat. Which will definitely help. Okay, we should be good. It's saved. It shouldn't go anywhere. I'm sure hoping that's the case. Now, if that's the case, we've got to run over to our car. We've got to get some shit going with that because we've got to pick up our weapons. Um, and we'll probably have to take... They didn't... I wanted to see if they searched, too. And it looks like they're not searching anyone. They're just kind of letting people go on the on the pier. Which, obviously, that makes sense. I don't know what type of event it is, but it looks like some type of car meet that has a very large police presence. <laughs> Uh, but they're not searching anyone, so that's good. So that means I can take my weapons, possibly make my way to the end of the pier. And instead of shooting from across the street, I could shoot from inside there and make my getaway from inside the pier. Which actually would be pretty cool. Um, because if I have to go... I mean, even if I shoot from here, they're gonna, they're gonna get a location because it's shot spotter. So they might actually have that on the radar and can hit that location pretty quick. And it seems like they have all of their resources at the event instead of like around the event, like on the streets and stuff like that. Or maybe some people patrolling the outside, which would always be good if you had some people patrolling on the outer, outermost edges. Uh, that way you have some people who can see what's going on versus just at the event. Because that's where shit could get bad for the, the side that's at least trying to defend something. Um, you just, you have no element of a game plan. It's just... You're gonna have to react instead of, you know, think of it. You're on your on your own on your own terms. You just gotta react to what the fuck someone else is doing. Okay, good. Someone took all my weapons and someone rolled down my windows again. What's going on with this car, dude? All right, let's get our weapons. Manage. We'll get these weapons back. That's why streaming some of the stuff would be nice because I could just ask you guys, well, what do you want to see? Do you want to see a sniper shot or should we go onto the beach or onto the pier? Which I can already actually envision what you guys would want to see. Which would probably be going onto the pier. So, if we're going to do that, I probably should move my car. Because if they search the area and find my car, it's going to be a pretty big giveaway. That, um, no suitable vehicle found, eh? I'm pressing it, mate. Unlock the goddamn car. Alright, we're going to we're gonna have to respawn it then. Alright, 48, it's new car. Uh, we need to park it somewhere else. We did get gas, but I guess we lost that gas. We're not going to be using the car as a getaway anyways. We just kind of used it to get over here. We need to find a good spot to kind of store the car at for the time being. Maybe the parking lot would be good. But I feel like it would be too close to what is going on here. So we probably want to go like a, a block or two down. Find an alleyway. We could park it there. I think behind the building would have been a little too suspicious though. This is like a single alleyway here. Let's not do that. Oh, this is pretty nice. We'll just park it right here. I don't know why the windows keep rolling down, but hopefully they stay where they're at. Maybe it's the auto lock that's doing it. Okay, we're chilling now. Probably when I get away from it. Alrighty, let's see what we can do here. I'm hoping this will go good. I'm hoping I won't get caught on the pier with guns and then they just shoot me <laughs> shoot me dead. Oh, that would not be good. And it's nighttime now, so I have the element of surprise when it comes to what I'm doing. Instead of walking around in broad daylight, which was a little sketchy. But then again, all we needed to do there was just kind of get a lay of the land, see what was going on. And now I'm feeling a little bit more confident. We get back up there. I'll play it cool as we walk past them. We'll go up into like the, I don't know, I don't know, a roller coaster. I totally blanked there. Oh yeah, the element of surprise at night is so much better, dude. So once we get up here, we're just going to start walking. He walks up those stairs super fast, like he's running. Okay, that's Target right there. Looks like Target's actually walking in and out. I don't know if he's still carrying the same fucking box. But it looks like he's walking, he keeps walking in and out of this roller coaster area here. I don't know if my guns are silenced or not. No, that's not. I should probably put a silencer on it. I keep those in my pockets all the time just in case, you know? Okay, I've done, I can't hear anyone so we're going to have to stand up. And I'm going to have to keep looking around. 
That way I can try to find something here. I gotta find uh, a place to take the shot, but I do have to be wary about the cop that's walking around with the dog. Uh, we've been in here for a little bit of time now, so we've got to start getting to the point where we get ready to take the shot on the guy. I've pretty much felt the uh, lay of the land, which is nice. And I, I kind of know where everyone's at. It looks like we just have one walker, which is kind of walking around, which is the dog and the officer. Which the dog can run pretty fast, but uh, kind of has to wait for the officer's command to actually do anything. So we'll, we'll probably be good. I'm going to see if I can get up this exit here and maybe work my way up the roller coaster. I just don't see where the cop's at. Oh shit, there's someone up here. Hey man, you mind if I go up there and take like a selfie or something? Is that cool? Yeah, that's cool. Alright man, appreciate it. Please don't fall. <laughs> I don't want to fall. Let me just kind of play it cool here and I want to look at a broad picture and see where everyone's at. I think I know what I want to do though. I can run over here. I just got to figure out where the water's at or where the water starts so I don't fall onto land and break my neck. I hear a car over here, though. Oh, wait, it's my boat. It's the it's the jet ski or the boat. That's what I hear. Oh, we're good. So I have a feeling someone's going to definitely see me up here. Oh, we just got to play it cool. Let's play it cool. It's a nice night. You know, there's nothing that should be piquing their interest or anything like that. Oh, why do they have lights on? Dude, this might be the spot. This might be the spot. Oh, no, no. Those roofs look pretty good, too. Honestly, I'd have a lot more cover on the roof. Because right now, I'm just kind of out in the open. If that if that LEO guy with his dog is walking around, he will see me up here. Like, no doubt. Oh, I don't know. This is a nice spot, though. Oh, my God. This is a nice spot because no one would be looking up here. No one would need to look at the top of this. And what, what, I, what I would need to do... I would run down the stairs, go across the platform, across that guy. Probably knock him out really quick because he knows too much. Go across the roller coaster seats, go and walk down that way, jump into the water, and then get to the boat. Okay, Elio might actually see me because they're walking in the middle. I don't know if they actually see me, though. They could just be walking. I'm going to go ahead and let's hold the system really quick. Because again, they're way too close for comfort. Like if they were at the front over there, it would probably be better. Uh oh, everyone's starting to move around. What's going on? Are they all down at the other side? What the fuck? Oh god, Elio's running again. I don't think they see me. I really hope they don't see me. What are they doing inside there? I don't know. The way that they're moving around is super weird. It's like they're trying to like find a way to get up and talk to me. Okay, there's the LEO guy and his dog. Oh, he wasn't even back here, dude. I could have fucking... Could have done it. Let's have him... Wa oh, uh-oh. He's running from the play. Why, why? How can I not hear them? How can I not hear them? Maybe if I uh, change some stuff around, I could possibly hear them. Okay, there might be a little too much people over here to actually feel comfortable taking the shot now. Also, daytime. Oh, fuck. Oh, I don't know. This is a nice spot. Right? I didn't even see this, dude. Look at this little, like, control box right here. Oh, fuck. You've got guards at the front. But the only problem is I'm so high up and I'd have to go so far back to get to the boat. I have a feeling they see me. I feel like if I just stay super still, maybe they won't because there's no reason for them to look up that high. I don't even see all the people though. I don't know. Oh wait, there he is. He's still just standing in the front. What is he doing?
literally he's holding the box. He's been holding the box for what it seems to be like forever up in this bitch. Okay, he's walking back in. I'm gonna go across this. I'm gonna I'm gonna follow him. Oh, and he just fucking U-turned. Uh-oh, who's this? Who's this? Hey man. How you doing? Hola, como estás? Hey. <laughs> it's a person! How are you doing, my friend? Oh good, just smoking a cigarette up here. Who the fuck is on oh, here? Oh si, senor. Oh yeah, yeah, it's a good place. Si, si. All right, well, I'm afraid to hide, so I'm gonna get down now. <laughs> si. I thought it was at first. I thought it was a broken character. I was like, dude, this broken ass AI is running up the fucking stairs. Uh oh, and here goes the fireworks. Thanks for, thanks for letting me take that picture, man. I appreciate it. Dude, the fireworks. That was my idea. I was going to get the fireworks and then... Um... Oh, shit. He's got a launcher over there, too. Gotta love it. Okay, well, it's daytime now, so I fucked up the ability to be able to take the shot here, but I had to see what was going on with that roller coaster to be able to do anything anyways. So we're going to probably have to go to our original location, which is across the street, and shoot him. Because I feel like that's the only place we're going to be able to do this without it fucking everything up. Because if we're inside this thing with how, how many cops are in the middle now, it won't work. Like, they're running around and shit, looking at the fireworks, so it's just going to... It's that our target is using the firework launcher. Oh, what is the cop doing? Is he going up there? I think he was trying to. I think he was going to go get that guy that walked up there. I have no idea. Dude, he's right here all by himself. What the fuck? But there's way too many people around. Way too many people around. What's up, bro? What's up? What's up? A lot. What is up, bro? I can't have too much conversations with these people. I can't have everyone see me and be like, well, I need to talk to this guy. Because then it's going to fuck up the undercoverness. Dude, I was going to shoot him there, but I really wasn't sure if those were people or not. Okay, I know what I need to do here. I need to get... We're either getting back to the original place where we're at. We have to get the car and move it back up. Or we're going to go to this, like, hotel, motel, which has a balcony. I know I can get up on there. If I can get up on there, I take the shot, I run down, and we'll make our escape. Now, there is going to be some officers in the area. They're obviously getting antsy because it's been so long. So we want to make sure that we uh, we have our getaway car. Let's, let's go ahead and put a step up into it. So the boat was a good idea to get positioned there, but it just did not work the way I assumed it was going to. Which is unfortunate, but that's just how it goes sometimes. So we've got to get down. Yeah, so I think this place has some... T oh, actually, you might only be able to get to it with a helicopter. I know it has some type of, like, uphill garden thing on, like, the second story. But I don't think we can get to it unless we have a helicopter now that I think about it. It might be, like, a GT Online only thing. Okay, car is still there, so let's go ahead and get the car... We're going to get a little closer to the target and try to find a roof. Now, I know what roof we can use, which is the... How, how? How do I have to break my own car? I think I went a little too far away from it. God, I really hope there's no undercover oracles out. That would be horrible. Oh, you know what? I might be able to take the shot from this little roof right here. This little balcony, dude. Look at this shit. I've never been on here either, so this would be perfect to be able to utilize this. Then I just jump down from the roof. Oh, it'd be perfect. Okay, so it looks like it's completely fenced in. There's no way to get through it unless you jump it. Oh man, almost. 
Almost. I wonder if GTA will let me actually get on it without having to do some jank shit. Actually, I might be able to use my car. Nope. I'm getting on this roof, damn it. I know it's possible. This looks like a bitch-ass roof, and it looks totally accessible. And I'm gonna get on it. I don't want to freak out any of these people that are living here, but I am getting on this roof. There has to be a back way. This looks way more elevated. Oh shit. That's the roof. That's the fucking roof. And it's literally... It is literally the perfect height. Literally the perfect height. Okay, before we pull out a gun... Let's pull out the binoculars. We gotta see what's going on. I wanna try to get a... Exact picture. Oh my god, everyone's in a group right now. Oh my god, this would be the perfect time to take the shot. Oh my god. It would be good. And then I'll jump down on my roof. Why can't I see? Oh no! No, I forgot this isn't a sniper. It's a fucking marksman. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hold on. I gotta grab the sniper rifle from the trunk. Dude, cannot believe it. Cannot. I, I totally fucking forgot. Alright, we gotta get the uh, suitcase. Which it's gonna be the titanium one, because you already know. Let's shut the trunk. We gotta go back up there. We're gonna have to set the gun up with a silencer. How you doing? I like to run with my metallic suitcase. We're all good here, sir. And we've got to put that bitch on and we're going to take the shot. If they're all standing in a circle, dude, that would be a perfect time. Oh, relax, man. I'm just... Okay, shit. God damn, he got freaked out for no reason. Just running, man. Oh, this is going to be... Oh, wait. Oh, GTA. Why do you got to fuck with me, dude? That is a perfect... Ba Ugh. That bush is perfect. I don't know why I can't climb up it. Then I'd be able to get up on the roof right there. Fucking A, dude. Okay, to be safe here, we're going to set up the gun right here on the bush. So that way, no one can see us. We're going to go to sniper rifles. I want to mark... Actually, if I do that... What's a bolt end muzzle? Oh, that looks cool. Zoom scope. Advanced scope? What's the difference? Okay, that just looks to be the regular scope that you can get. Oh. That looks like a cool crosshair, though. What am I taking the shot with someone like that? Night vision. Oh my god, that suppressor looks so good. Okay, so we've got armor piercing rounds. We've <laughs> Oh god. Oh no, that's not what I wanted. No, I don't want explosives are in center. I want armor piercing. And then I want an extended magazine. So we've got even more rounds. Oh, this is it! Dude, I need to do it right now. I need to do it right now because if they're gonna be doing that. Okay, it's going down. I gotta cancel the suitcase. Oh, I can't see him! Dude, they're all standing in the same fucking line and I can't see him. Where oh, is that him? I think that's him. That motherfucker just dropped, dude! Yo! Yo, that motherfucker just dropped. I, I really... <laughs> oh my god. Hold the phone, dude. Hold the phone. Yo, he just slept. Hold on, we gotta get to a better position. I need to verify targets down. No one heard a thing. We had the suppression and then the fucking launchers. 
No one heard a thing. Hold the phone. Let me get down here really quick. Yo. I think he was the only one standing off to the side like a dumbass. I gotta get to high ground really quick. Oh my god, that was so worth the time scoping the area. Holy shit. That sniper was beautiful. Beautiful. Let's get up here. I need high ground so I can see what's going on. Oh my god, this would have been a great area too. What? Look at this bitch. Okay, let's... Uh, I haven't heard a single rocket. I guarantee everyone's freaking out. Everybody's freaking out. Uh-oh. Did I get the right person? Uh-oh. Why did they all just disappear? No! <laughs> no! Where'd you all go? Oh, am I too far? Where is my sniper? Oh, here it is. Let's see if I can... Uh... Oh, wait. That's him. Oh, I got him! <laughs> I got him again! I don't know if I got him the first time. Okay, go down normal. Okay, I... <laughs> oh, that sack of shit, dude. Oh, twice. We gotta go right now. We gotta go right now. We gotta go right now, bro. Jump! There we go. Oh my god, dude. That was definitely him. He dropped right in front of the cop, but I, he was walking, so I don't think I got the right target. I think I might have accidentally killed the wrong target. But I got him on the way back down. That fucking ammo is so fucking good, dude. Oh. Uh, let's see. DSW to mail on poster is head. DSW to person on stairs was chest. Both armor. Okay, I hear hella sirens and like air horns and shit, so we might want to, um, we might want to bounce. That was a good uh, Hitman contract, though, I gotta admit. I was in for, in, in here for like an hour and 20 minutes to get that, but it pretty much was like 40 minutes was us kind of walking around looking to see exactly what we could, where we could go. I gotta find like a location to go to. I th always thought you could drive up that. What the fuck? I had no idea it was just a dead-end parking lot. So yeah, we don't have our guns on us, so that's good. So even if it did go south there, we wouldn't have had the guns on us. We would have had a gun on us, but nothing that would have been associated to the crime that happened over there, which is good. I kind of just want to run these and just get through traffic and hope to God that no one sees me because if they see me driving away super fast like this, oh, definitely going to be a little suspicious. This will be a good spot, though, at Simi... Oh, it's not Simeon's. This is uh, not the right way. I forgot what this... Benny's, Benny's, Benny's. I was like, how the fuck did I forget what the name of this is? We'll just pull in here. That way we could get out of out of the world. I'd say that was good, though. For us having to spend as much time as we did, go around and actually look for, you know, the target and see what he was doing. It seems like he was just kind of having fun hanging out. I don't know why he was carrying a box as much as he was. He was really steadfast on that box. I don't, I don't know why. But nonetheless, it was fun to actually get in here and do a contract in GTA. It's always a different experience than playing the actual game like I always put on the channel. But I, I enjoy it. It's fun. Um, and we can start doing a lot more stuff. And this is how I want to do contracts where people send in uh, what the contract is by very minimal stuff. I can show you guys on the screen. And then we go and try to handle the contract together, which would be really, really fun. Because it would make it a little more unknown. I can't get the clipping just right. But this is a pretty badass jack and I can't wait to use it for future Hitman episodes. But again, thank you all so much for coming out and watching 900 episodes. I've said that 900 times, and that is just truly amazing, just like everything else in these uh, episodes that we do. But 
it's been a great ride and it's uh, definitely been fun creating all the content and creating these characters that you guys have loved so much and just been able to make these awesome stories. And with all this new stuff coming to DOJ, it's just going to amplify these stories and characters and new characters and memories and all that fun stuff. So again, thank you all so much for coming out and watching this episode, the ninth Hunters episode of DOJ, and we will see you next video.